Monarch butterfly has been struggling, but the populations are showing some signs of improvement. Fox 2 meteorologist Angela Huddy is live from the butterfly house tonight in Faust Park with more on what is really good news, Angela. Mandy, it is some really good news. Now here at the Saks Butterfly House, aside from these wings back behind me, you won't find any monarch butterflies right now, but you will find some scientists inside that are very happy to hear this news and very happy to see that conservation efforts appear to be helping out. So every year, a dedicated group of citizen scientists basically go out and hand count the monarch butterfly populations that are there, mostly in Southern California. After a dangerous drop in the count, the population of western monarch butterflies wintering in western states has rebounded for a second year in a row. Two years ago, there were only about 2,000 overwintering monarch butterflies left. Last year, that number increased dramatically to about a quarter million. This year, it's up to over 350,000 monarch butterflies. That's the highest number in the last six years. It's a sign that conservation efforts are working, but the population of western monarchs is still well below what it used to be. 10 years ago, that number could have been a million or higher, and so there's still a lot of room for improvement. Meanwhile, here in Missouri and Illinois, we can help eastern monarchs and other butterflies by being more pollinator friendly in our gardening and planning. By increasing your native plants in your front yard or your backyard or your garden, reducing the use of pesticides, working with your government to plant more wildflowers along highways, things like that are going to help all native insects, not just the monarch butterfly. New signage going up outside the Butterfly House in Faust Park will educate visitors on ways to do just that. And speaking of coming out here to the Butterfly House, they're back open after their annual January closure, ready to welcome you back. They have their Morf Morpho Mardi Gras going on. Thousands of blue Morpho uh, butterflies, excuse me, are being released inside, plus lots of fun beads and Mardi Gras and music theme fun for your whole crew as well. Reporting live in Chesterfield tonight, I'm meteorologist Angela Huddy, Fox 2 News.